I think most of you will not believe me when I say that 2 plus 2 is equal to 5 because we have studied in school that according to mathematics, 2 plus 2 is 4. But today, I will prove that 2 plus 2 equals 5. Let us see how we can do that. First of all, we will start with something that we all know, and that is, if I take 0 on the left-hand side, then it must be equal to 0 on the right-hand side, right? You all agree with me on this. Now we can rewrite this 0, which is on the left-hand side, as 24 minus 24, right? We can do that because 24 minus 24 is 0. Similarly, we can rewrite this 0, which is on the right-hand side, as 30 minus 30, right? Yes, we can do that because, again, 30 minus 30 is simply 0. Now what we will do is we will factor out this 24 as 4 times 6 because 4 times 6 is 24, and thus this part is correct. Similarly, we can factor out this 30 as 5 times 6 because 5 times 6 is 30. I think you know this much? Then what we do is take 4 common from the left side. So 4 times 6 minus 4 times 6 becomes 4 times bracket 6 minus 6. And from the right side, we take 5 common. So 5 times 6 minus 5 times 6 becomes 5 times bracket 6 minus 6. That looks fine, right? Awesome! Now, here comes the magic. Since both sides have this 6 minus 6, we divide both sides by 6 minus 6 like this. So now, the 6 minus 6 cancels out on both sides, and we are left with 4 equals 5. Yes, you heard that, right? 4 equals 5, which means 2 plus 2 equals 5, because 4 is just 2 plus 2. Wait, is that really possible? Ha 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 ha. See, I told you that. I can prove 2 plus 2 equals 5. Okay, let me be honest and tell you that if you go through the steps properly, you'll notice I've cleverly broken a rule of math without telling you all, because obviously, this is not correct. The correct version is 2 plus 2 equals 4. I think 98% of you might have made the same mistake. Now, if you are really a genius, try to spot exactly where the mistake happened. So good.